Yeah, TV Fox Rage Quarters is just not like go, go. go any for me to uh, It's very unfortunate, sometimes it happens, but Ready? So, yeah, so we got Music Queen PTK. Yeah, those are the, semis. You know what uh, his sponsor means? YBM. Yeah, BM. <laughs> yeah, boy, Music Queen? Yeah, yeah boy, M, Music Queen. Uh, I'll ask him about that. Anyway, so, uh. <laughs> this is. Okay, so when you're in a best class situation, it's, it's so sad. Especially when you're playing Spacey because he has FD, Dreamland, and Fountain. And what uh, do you have? You have Pokemon Stadium Yoshi's. Is and Yoshi's Peter, can actually go against you. Is Peter the type of player that that, that would laser camp? Because I feel like laser camping would definitely help him out, especially uh, in Dreamland. Laser camping? He's not going to get much out of laser camping at this point because you know, Mewtwo Queen is very. Punish heavy? Yeah, punish heavy. So if he gets a power shoot while running towards you and you're stunned for that moment. He's gonna go for a near fall or something. It's just not yeah, I'm, I'm really liking these reverse toads from YouTube Queen to get uh, ready a bear when it comes back on stage. Getting bad battlefield? No, this is a good stage. For, are you kidding me? It's a good stage for Peach as long as Falco doesn't take the first stock. But as as uh, as Juice was just saying, uh, Peter's not the type of player to camp. Which which is really the problem with battlefield with Peach Falco. Uh, Winter Game Fest was actually. Uh, or second arcade. Yeah, I was so able to go. But. You should. So, um, we are gonna definitely have another um, winning game fest. I'm not sure if it's gonna be third arcade. Game. No, I probably, probably shouldn't be. It should not be. I feel like it really deteriorated. Like, especially the ranked players who came, even though the Eric Crew battle didn't mean much because of that. Yeah. Tilted. But, uh, it, it really deteriorates like really good players in the world because. Yeah, I'm sure you have the Arcadians like really shine out. Like yeah. you should have like they had Arcadian doubles only, which I thought was one of the stupidest ideas. It also ran really late, or like mid singles run really late. Yeah, like, oh, double doubles really has a if you people. if you run doubles and singles at the same time, you really have to make sure that feel like it doesn't run singles really late because doubles should have um, allowed ranked players. Yeah, because, or like not like ranked players and ranked players can like, be together. Or previous ranked players. Can be oh no! What should have? That was the smartest idea I've ever seen in my entire life. Peter, oh Peter tried God. to get back up more damage just by going right straight into him. No, no, no! It's because um, Aaron actually knew, like not even actually he didn't know, but he reacted to him going towards stage. So what he did was instead of throwing it. He dropped, Z dropped it. it. Oh, I didn't notice he dropped so, it. So he actually didn't take as much damage as he would have if he threw it. Yeah. I mean, oh my god, that's so much. I mean, Aaron, Aaron practices a lot uh, by himself, so you know, it's really, really. <laughs> it's, um, it's really crazy to see the stuff he can do after you know hours and hours of practice like that. Yeah, there's a smash right here at UCSD called uh, Tri Weekly. That's the name Tri Weekly. So if you're in San Diego, you're in San you Diego. Definitely come. There's also SCSU Bi Weekly. So if you're near the SCSU area or like El Cajon, you know, yeah, hit them up. I believe that's still at Clockworks. Mm -hmm. And uh, there is also a tabletop commons. Do not know what that is. That's around uh, Hillcrest. Hillcrest. Okay, so if you're around Hillcrest, definitely search up tabletop or not uh, tabletop, tabletop. Commons. <laughs> <laughs> tabletop, tabletop commons. And uh, yeah, I heard it was a really nice idea too. Yeah, that's uh, it's, it's a bi-weekly. Bi-weekly. So, yeah. Um, if you can't make it for STC bi-weeklies, go to that. There's also last on here in Merriman, or not here, but in Merriman. In Merriman, it's, it's, it's a weekly. It's a weekly, yeah. Weekly, which is really awesome. Do not know when Donut Pad is. Every yeah. other Sunday, I think? I'm not sure. Yeah, it should be every other Sunday. It, it transitions. So, the so, meal, like, while, while this is going on, yeah, Peter would just shoving me to bring around and gets a stock with a bear. Uh, actually, um, they don't play. JDR and PTK actually do not play. I actually do Any, not know what happened to JJR. Anymore? What? Yeah, what What did happen to JJR? I'm not sure. Like he, he, I, I know for a fact Dia and PK play a lot. Yeah, they definitely do. JJR is always on screen. But anyway, here we go. Um, the FD counter pick, which ma makes sense for, for, for Peach versus Spacey's because you know, all you need is one grab, and it's a really silly chain grab all the way up to death, pretty much. Oh, this is just a sad main stage. It's like. Not <laughs> yeah, Mewtwo Queen's doing really well with uh, these power shield lasers. What? Oh my god! That was... Do you think? Do you think Peter should try uh, empty lasers to try and trip up Mewtwo Queen's timing? Yeah, I don't think he should try to empty lasers because um, he 
he's probably hella not used to it. It's not in his play style. I see, okay. I have to speak more? You have to speak more? Alright. Okay. So, hello, hello, friends. I, I'm sorry that. Oh, no, the umbrella combo! Oh my gosh, so he tried going for the umbrella combo. He, he didn't get the down smash, though. Uh, PTK was able to, uh, I guess, SDI out of it. Barely. Ooh! I, that would have been Hi, a great Yoshi. down smash situation. Hi, Yoshi! Yeah, Justin? Yeah, it's. Um, I'm not Justin. I'm not Justin. But, uh. <laughs> okay, so basically, <laughs> this is such a bad situation. For uh, PTK, if he gets oh, if he gets grabbed, yeah, if Mewtwo Queen gets back on the stage and he gets one grab, then it's well, the, the, the chain grab is guaranteed from like twenty five percent onward, correct? Sixty percent. Oh, that's, that's easy to do with one down smash. Never mind. That, and, that, yeah, see, yeah. He, like he I, needed to make sure he was off the stage because is that stage? No, no. I, th I think Peter wanted to go shine stall and then uh, up B, but. Or a second jump up B, but he didn't realize he didn't have a second jump. So the reverse toad recovery is really working out. It's working out for him, yeah. For some reason, if Peach's butt gets hit, she can uh, toad still react. Oh my gosh, and PTK is being very impatient going for that raw F smash. Yeah. And, and it kind of worked out, but he's taking a lot of collateral damage for it. Yeah, he took 47%. I oh no, I he jumped straight into the chain grab. Look, I've said this uh, many times every single I commentate, and I'm not getting any. Like, you know, new material. Is that a stitch? Oh, oh Peter didn't notice. This cannot be happening right Peter didn't notice okay, the so stitch. That I was always bad. say this, but the two to three stock deficit, or like scenario, most important stocks, because um, it really determines whether or not you're it, down it, it, two it, stocks. It determines the pace your, of the game and it yeah. determines your mentality. Yeah. Because now Peter's trying to like swing a lot more desperately, it feels like. And you can see right now Peter's starting to turn, up, turn it up. What's up? Like, just look at the background. So yeah. yeah. Lights coming out. It's like a disco wall. Uh huh. <laughs> Alright, so oh, Peter's trying to finish the stock, but he's getting too impatient. He uh, took, yeah. a lot of, took a lot of like, other damage. Up throw down smash is guaranteed at 0%, and that's a straight up 36% combo. 32, yeah, Peach doesn't have the JC grab because her dash, uh, dash grab and her standing grab animation takes the same amount of time. So, 1 1 right now. PDK probably gonna go to stadium, I think, right? Honestly, I feel like the stadium is the best. No, he lost on that. Oh, he did. Pokemon Stadium would be the best pick for him. However, Unless he wants I to go back to I, stadium. However, I feel like it's not as good of a counter pick stage for him. He's playing Falco. He's playing Fox in the Or Yoshi's. Yoshi's yeah, okay. okay. So, Yoshi's, I agree with. I feel like Yoshi's, he could do a lot more. It works with Peter's aggressive style, which is currently kind of working out. Ooh, okay. I'm not. Why did, why did Peter jump? Did he not want to up tilt? No, that was fun. Okay. For sure, fun. Unless he was trying to go for. He was trying to read. Read it down air or something? Read it down smash or something, but then again, doing that ultra to cover down smash does not work because they still get caught out. Because the duration of down smash is really, really long. It's yeah. so stupid, honestly. <laughs> it's Sometimes, so like, Peach is kid. Like, for all the cool things Peach can do, the kid's actually very stupid. Yeah? Like, how her dash attack stays out for so long and how down smash is like, how many hits of 16 damage? Yeah, I know, it's so stupid. But, uh, honestly, I feel like Peach is such a cool character. Definitely a very uh, heavy punished character for a lot of <laughs> for a lot of characters in this game. Then so, I thought he's down two stocks in hundred minutes. Yeah. What are supposed to do this? Shine spiked with Falco. That's new. Huh. I, I guess Mewtwo Queen was holding in and he just bounced off the stage. Oh, that's so risky. What he did was trying to go for up air. He went for up air, yeah. He said, down smash. Oh, that up there. Aaron, in his mind, like, he had one, like, command and, like, once, like, some one sentence, like, repeating over and over. I have to get off this platform. I have to get off this platform. But it never occurred to him that he could have down smashed after that. He was too, he was thinking it was tunneling too hard, and I thought. Yeah. Yeah. He, he had many options out of the case. I mean, he went for double up air. He could have done shield drop up air. He could have uh, down smash because he would have gone out. Mm -hmm. He could have jumped up, but. And now, actually, yeah, he could have done what he just did. But, uh, oh, he got the situation again. Okay, he, he did. I, I, think really he's, I think he's too focused on the, those shield drops to get out of those bad situations right now. Shield drops don't even like that, honestly. I really wish I shield drop. It's faster. Yeah. It's, it's honestly really hard. 
<laughs> My problem is shield dropping when I want to, but regardless, back to the match. Yeah, regardless, back to the match. We all wish we could shield drop with like easy acts. Ooh! And that's a common, like, like tendency that yeah. levels usually do. Right when they get on the stage, they want to go for a shine. Or if they're in, like, a precarious, close quarter situation, they'll go for a shine. Out of a shield or shine out of spot or something. Spot or shine, out of a shine out of the like, gauge. But, um, yeah. But right now, yeah. Peter, Peter. It looks like he actually started a laser camp. Um, I, I, this might be a desperation move just to try and like rack up more damage so he doesn't get rocked like that. Really in this situation, you can't really use laser to advantage because he's, he's in the smallest stage of the game. Or legal. Yeah, it's stage. Yeah, smallest legal stage. So there's not much you can do, especially with his laser style where he only does um, short hop lasers on ground and never does a full hop. Oh yeah. no. Then you can see in Peter's face. Was... Now my my interesting thought was why is Peter doing often to do up throw with Falco? Why not forward throw? Um. Okay. I'm thinking he's trying to get some, like trying to catch him off with like an aerial, or he's maybe trying to hit him with the the laser and hoping that's gonna. Taking out the float, float maybe. But it's it's not working out. Uh, so <laughs> he needs to figure out some way to adapt. And at this point, it looks like he's trying to platform camp. He's trying to, or he's just, or he's being cornered on the platform. Yeah, either right? he's trying to platform camp, or he's just like he doesn't understand what his. Uh... Yeah, he's definitely like, looking. He's, fe he's feeling really pressured right now. He's, like, he's definitely looking a lot, of, really frustrated. But I think he's just being cornered on the platforms, honestly, because he's not trying to make the platforms to his to his advantage right, right now. Yeah, Aaron's more just facing and just like base management in general. Very frustrating to play against. Because I feel like you can't move. You feel like you're really. Ooh! And you can see in Peter's face too. That was just not good. Yeah, that was that was frustrating. Um, how do you feel about up tilt in this matchup with Falco? Um, it's gonna be really tough for him to get an up tilt in this situation. Because if uh, Aaron reads that he's trying to do an up tilt the right when uh, he's trying to fast forward to the real, then he can just react and Aaron just decided to react to the player. Okay. So it's. Because one reason, one reason why I'm asking that is because I'm noticing that Peter is putting putting him in these situations where he's landing um, with Peach behind him, and I feel like either he, he he could either bear or he could up tilt. Both I think he can get a lot of mileage out of, but he's uh I think he might be respecting uh YouTube being spacing a little too much, but you know for for a good reason these punishes oh, are he's really stuck on the top platform. Really, really insane right now. And that's why he's not doing lasers, because he knows for a fact that if he gets laser, his momentum's too long. And he can't do any of the, like, the cool, and if, like, aggressive yeah. stuff he's using yeah, yeah, and then his momentum stop. And Aaron definitely has shown that he can power shield lasers very consistently. Yeah. He's basically oh no, not right a good now. trade. He is basically a skill right now. Shout out to Jeff, I don't know who you are, and I hope you were here. I would have seen if he was here. You want to play Jeff that bad? I do, I love Jeff. He was awesome. you will love Jeff. Oh, where's our, where's our Jeff emotes? Get some Jeff emotes in chat. so good at power shooting, you should go for the down smoke more often. If you miss the PS, you'll just pop and say, this room is Yeah, 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 yeah. I've seen that a lot. I actually. think he just did it, actually. <laughs> Any, oh, yeah, I did not see, but yeah, I've seen that. Oh, that's a, that's a CC, CC down when smash. When he can just go for the easy, peasy down smash. Which is just... Yeah. But, uh, <laughs> 